Hey, excuse me. Do you know that like landmark in St. Louis here that's like well known for the town? This gateway? No, it's not that. It's like a big arch, but sort of different. No, it's not that. What is going on? Welcome back to another Van Life series. This is the first episode of what will be a about a month long Van Life series. If you're new here, welcome to the Magnificent Van Mobile. This is actually a Patreon funded series. So I gotta give a huge thank you to all the guys on Patreon helping us pay for gas along the way. If you want more info on that, check out the links in the description. So right now, we are actually en route to St. Louis. And if you guys have been following along this whole time, I've been telling you guys, we're flying under the arch for this big air show event. But I kind of have some potentially bad news. It sounds like at this point in time, there's a better chance that we won't be allowed to fly under the arch. So that means the show will still go on, but I think we'll most likely just fly next to the arch, which is still really freaking cool. Like no one else gets to fly paramotors in the middle of a city next to the gateway arch in St. Louis. But we'll have to see. I'm not giving up hope yet. I think there still might be a shot that we'll get to fly under it. We have two demos on the 4th of July. So maybe after the first one, they'll see that, you know, we're responsible and we can handle it. I don't know. Stick around to find out. This episode is going to be like our road trip to St. Louis and then all the prep work that goes into preparing for the air show. If you're not subscribed yet, hit that button to stay tuned for the next episode to see what actually happens. And uh, cross your fingers that they actually let us go under it. We're really hoping. this van life trip has probably given me the most trouble out of all of them. First up, I was cruising through DC and I smelt something burning. A couple minutes passed by with no solution. I just thought it was outside in the wind and freaking smoke comes out of the uh, fan speed selector switch. So I have AC technically, but I have no fan speed. It's stuck on zero. So it's freaking hot just cruising around in the sun. Um, the next trouble was when I did the oil change there's two positions that the o-ring on the oil filter can go I've been putting it in the same position the same time just how I take it off and turns out that's the wrong position and I started leaking oil and we probably lost like half a liter the light came on I pulled over found the issue fixed it and added more oil and now we're good later well a day later we made it to st louis um my man travis just sent me this address here i have no freaking idea where i'm at we're at an airport there's a fedex jet over there we've got a bunch of small planes over here i don't even know why we're here um a couple of guys our buddy david on the team and uh eric aka mom the uh the ringleader they're flying in this afternoon i don't know if they're supposed to land here or if we're here to practice or but I did pass the Martins, they're here, so I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll see how she tumbles. I'm just gonna stand around until something happens. You! It is hot in here. I need to get the AC fixed. Um, but so here's the scoop. We just met up with everyone except for Eric and David and uh, The group's kind of split some of us are in a hotel. Some of us are camping out in the giant ass trailer mobile, but um, 
So basically, the air show part of this whole thing is a little bit bigger than I expected. Uh, there's a bunch of acts. I thought it was just kind of like a street fair and then like a couple air show flyovers, but it's actually like a legitimate air show going on. Um, so there's a lot of coordination, like any air show that has to go on. I gotta follow these guys. Man, mobile! So yeah, that means there's a lot of like coordination. There's a lot of um, briefings and stuff like that that we have to get to. Uh, so basically now we're going to the hotel. We're gonna get checked in and then we're gonna eat dinner. And tomorrow we're gonna start off the day at like 9 a.m. with an air show brief. And after that, we've got like a bunch of prep work to do on the motors, logos on gliders, lights and stuff like that. Um, and just sorting out how the actual air show is gonna work. We might get a practice window tomorrow. That's the plane right now. The unfortunate part is we are not approved to fly under the arch, which is kind of a bummer. But at the same time, we're flying like over the river right in front of the arch and nobody gets to do that anyway. Um, apparently the concern is that it's like a national park where the arch is and they're not approving it. So unfortunate, maybe next year, who knows? You never know. That right there is about the best shot you're going to get of, uh, our flight area. Don't uh, vlog in traffic by the way. Apparently we're gonna set up on the opposite side of the river to launch. We gotta uh, find a place to launch first, a field of some sort, coordinate with police, and then we'll take off and fly over the river. Um, the, the plot of land around the arch is apparently like the national park area, and that's where we're not allowed to fly. And there's gonna be a lot of people there anyway, so I guess logistically it kind of is a little, oh my God, that boulevard says Tucker Boulevard. That's pretty rad. Um, anyway, yeah, logistically, it's a little bit awkward, I think. But it's gonna be sick regardless. Like, you just saw that, like, right by the freaking city. And this is, like, a big, well-known city. and I'm not sure what name they're under. Okay. Um, it'll What's type it? Paradigm. P-A-R-A-D-I-G-M. Other than looking like a freaking weirdo with two backpacks on, they serve hot, fresh cookies at the front desk. And did you know St. Louis is the home of Panera Bread? Oh, dude, check this out. You can see the freaking arch from here. I don't know if you can see it. I'll have to add in some crop factor there, but the arch is right out there. It's so sick. Pretty nice room, not gonna lie. I'm digging the free cookies. Act natural. I just feel like I have to channel my inner Tucker God. Hang on. Wait, dang it. You're failing me, hat. That's Tucker, that's. Don't look at him, that's not the real one. I'm the real Tucker God. Don't, 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 don't believe him. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna wrap this one up here. I kinda wanna do like daily vlog type things on this van life road trip adventure where some days it'll be spectacular. We'll fly next to the arch. Some days we'll just be, you know, like prepping like today. So drop a like if you like it. Tomorrow early morning, we're gonna get together for a briefing. And then hopefully if the weather allows and everything aligns, we'll do a practice flight tomorrow night, which will be awesome to get that in. The more flying we do like by the city, the better, because that's awesome. I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Check out the website and the Patreon down below. All the links, everything is down there, all you need to know. So I'll see you guys. Peace out.